question is this. You see, people want the instructing language in their schools to be local. I also see the difficulties about that. Because we have so many different people in the school. Okay? See, the cost, people don't understand that education using local languages everywhere will exponentially increase the cost. That's one. Two, it will limit the, 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 the teachers because it's not everybody who is in, in Lagos, for, for a teacher in Lagos, for example, who speak Yoruba fluently enough to teach in Yoruba. Okay, so you are limiting the kind of people you hire as teachers. And after a while, after primary, uh, primary school, those students, let, let's say as in a student who went to primary school in Yoruba land, taught in Yoruba. Now for, for something, for some reason, the family are, be, are transferred to Kano. Now they continue now. They continue in Hausa. In Hausa, in Hausa <laughs> which he, which he never let you in 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 Lagos or Ibadan. <laughs> See, there are there are so many so many challenges. Okay, doing that, there are so many challenges, and sometimes I think we get excited and put put some policies in place without. Thinking about think, th thinking about long term, what yeah. is the effect long term? What is the economic impact? You know. So I don't know. Do you have a, you have a view a view on this? Yeah, yeah. Um, really, since um, the nature of our country is such that we have so many languages, mm. so many languages, it would be pretty difficult to say this is the language that will unite everyone together it's pretty difficult mm. so but it's okay if there is a place for the learning of our languages yes so the the other side of it is that we are beaten we are ch we are chastised for speaking our languages in mm. our schools i mm. mean current yeah, wow! A, 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 really? A, a, public, a, a public, a a private school teacher told me that they don't allow students to speak um, vernacular. So school. your own language is now seen as vernacular. Ah, yeah, yeah, yeah. You will not be brilliant if you are speaking. English <laughs> that that's that. stupid. <laughs> <laughs> so you can see that we have taken it too too far. Yes, too far. So I think um, we have schools that do have a day as language day so the, in wow. five days there's one day to, you are permitted to speak but it doesn't work like that the children are not even interested again because you have you told them to speak the better language so they're not they're, they're not they're intelligent when you told them not to speak theirs for five four days the only one is to speak the other language is not good enough see. so they, they lose it wow mm -hmm. see so the other that, side that means we are we are we are making so many mistakes in so many places. But that is for the south of Nigeria. It does not apply to the north. The see, north will not agree with all, of, all those policies. Okay. So yeah. for, for, for me, for me, see, children can learn as many languages as you put absolutely. in front of them. Absolutely. Absolutely. See, I, 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 I learned Yoruba within a few months at age of five when I when my family moved to Ilaro. Mm -hmm. Ilaro. Okay. Within a few months, I could speak it over. <laughs> okay, me and my young younger sisters, yeah. right? I could speak, speak yeah. it over to today. Okay, we in fact in, in my in our house at home, me and my sisters, we speak mostly Yoruba. Okay, the only person who who couldn't I can't speak to the, even today is is my father. Okay. But everybody else.
can speak Yoruba fluently. Right? So, see, yeah. for me, I want us to learn as many languages as possible in our uh, locality. You see, I'm, I'm, I'm sad at that I never learned Hausa. But I, 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 I hear that Hausa is the most is the easiest one to learn. I, but that's great. Uh, that's but great. I, 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 I was never opportune to learn it. You know. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> you know? So, see, I want us to learn many as many languages as possible. But then we also need to acknowledge the need we, that we need we a, 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 a language, a common language that we all unify. can. Can, can unify us and allow us to communicate fluently, easily with each other, you know? Yeah. And, and we can, that will not cost us uh, an arm and leg to... But I hope you realize that Northern Nigeria is united by Hausa. I hope you realize. Yes, yes, yes. There are many, there are many states that they are not indigenously Hausa, but the language they use to unify them is not English, but Hausa. Okay. Okay. So we can see if the governor will address them. Let me take Plateau State. Plateau State is not Hausa at all at yes. all. Yes. Yes. Mm -hmm. The language their governor will use to address them is going to address them. Yeah. Is Hausa. Hausa. You understand? And mm -hmm. there are many states that that the language to address them is Hausa. Okay. Not, not. Not uh, English. If you go to, is it, they will tell you ba to the inchi. I don't wow. understand. That. Now, okay, that, that's good. That's good. Now the point is this: they, the people living in northern Nigeria, how how do they communicate with the rest? See, the majority of the twenty two hundred languages in Nigeria are below. Plateau. The majority, the majority of the 20, 200 languages in Nigeria are below plateau. Okay. So, how would they communicate if they insist on doing everything in Hausa? Okay. How would we, how would they, how would we all come together and do things together? No, of course they speak English. They go to school. They go okay. to school. <laughs> now, it's those that are hold on, hold on, hold on. See, the point is my, my point is this. How uh, I, I, I need to I need to get this right. How would we see I I want I want all of us to be communicate as easily as possible. Okay. Sure. Now, sure. if I could speak Hausa, I would be no. Okay, I can't, unfortunately. But see, a a ten year old child in Kanu, Sokoto, in Madagori, mm -hmm. and a ten year old, old child in Imo, in Ibado, in Oshu, in Enugu, I want them to be able to. Talk to with each, each other. See, the, the world today is fast paced. Okay. I want us to be able to see Nigeria is very important to the development of Africa, not only Nigeria. Yeah. So, language will be a very, very big tool for that development. Sure. Because, see, like I said, the information we need to build our country and our continent are already 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 there in books everywhere. Okay, so we need I we need to be able to read those books. Yes, yeah. yes, there, there are so many there are so many of those books written in in, in Arabic. Okay, mm -hmm. yes, but see, as Nigerians, we need to be able to read the same books in the same language, so that for the for the for the uni uni uh, unity, mm -hmm. yeah, yeah. So, see, these right. things are important. Sure, 
Yeah. You know, these things are important mm -hmm. because uh, mm -hmm. if you continue, everybody, every region or uh, every areas of, of Africa or Nigeria doing their own thing, we are we are separating ourselves further and further and further instead of right. uniting ourselves. Mm -hmm. So right. I mean, these these things are important to to discuss. You know, mm -hmm. anyway. So that's that's my that's my that's my view on these things. I agree. I agree with you on that. Mm.